is live in North Houston with an update on the distribution efforts. Rochelle. Christine, we are at the Rock Ridge Bend Apartments on Greens Drive in North Houston. And this is one of the city's water distribution sites in District B. Take a look. These two 18-wheelers, they just arrived here. They have thousands of, of water and hot food. And if you take a look right down here, there's several people already lined up waiting to get these supplies. It's a necessity everyone needs. Water. Feel good. I mean, feel great to me. I mean, I'm glad y'all doing this, uh, giving it a, a, a offering this water to the public, to the people, but they need it. We all need it. On Thursday, the city of Houston opened water distribution sites in each of the city's council districts. Tarsha Jackson represents District B. We're getting back to normal. Um, it's going to take a minute, but we're getting there, um, making sure that, you know, residents, now that their lights are on, we need water, and so making sure that they have so that they can, you know, function, you know, at least halfway normal. The new Faith Baptist Church on North Wayside Drive was one of many that received several cases of water. It's some relief after the city declared a boil water notice and thousands are still without power and water. It means a lot from what we've been through for this, this past week, something unusual. You know, we never know when these things happen and now we know what get into emergency mode while we stand. Mm -hmm and what we need to do and how to appreciate the good times. The J. Robinson Senior Community tells KPRC they plan to distribute water on Friday at 10 a.m. And back out here live, you can see a better look of all of the cars waiting in line to get a case of water and some hot food. Now, organizers tell me this is a drive through only event. It was supposed to start at 4, but the truck got here a little late. So right now, people are just waiting to get these supplies. That's the very latest reporting live here in North Houston. I'm Rochelle Turner, KPRC 2 News. The need is great as we can see, Rochelle. Thank you.